Well, after nearly 40 years of business, the last video rental store in Berkeley is getting ready to close its doors. Oh, the end of an era, and it's, it's, it's actually kind of sad. KPX 5's John Ramos tells us some customers are, in fact, calling it the end of an era. You know, I don't have it right here. I think some. Andy Katz has owned five star video rental in Berkeley for more than 30 years. And though it has become a favorite hangout for movie buffs, Andy realizes the writing is on the wall. Our clientele is aging, and it creates a vacuum on the lower ages, and it's not being filled. Younger people wouldn't be caught dead renting a disc. So this last movie rental business in Berkeley will close in June. Streaming services have already destroyed the large rental companies, and shops like Andy's now cater to people looking for lesser-known independent and foreign films. Richard Dempelwolf found the obscure Japanese film noir movie he was hunting for and says he's sorry that is coming to an end. Well, I was very disappointed, obviously, <laughs> because I had spoken to people here a month or two ago and they thought things were fine. Andy says things haven't gotten desperate yet, but he's facing a new lease and had to make a tough decision. Explain we're a doing bit. okay, but we won't, I think, within the next term of, of a lease. And so rather than go out on a low note, I'd rather go out on an okay note. <laughs> it's not okay with Jim McClure. The 85-year-old Richmond resident rents about eight DVDs a week and isn't sure he'll be able to figure out the internet to watch his movies on. This is, it's the end of my era. This is the era that I'm familiar with is, is ending. And it has ended already, so. But he's right. The world has already changed, and Andy says it would be foolish to try to hang on to a beloved but dying business. I don't want to spend six months in therapy after this is over just to get my life back to normal and be poorer for it. In Berkeley, John Ramos, KPIX 5. Well, they don't make steam engines anymore either, do they? The store is going to close for rentals June 17th. It's going to reopen on July 13th through the 15th to sell off the 18,000 movies in stock.